I'm painting the wall here, and what I'm doing is I'm cutting it in first all the way around the top and the bottom. And you can see here, I've cut the window in. And if you look here, I got a really lousy looking window. So I've scraped it a little bit. I'm going to put a whole lot of paint on there. And uh, I might have to give this a second coat. But I'm using very top quality expensive paint instead of cheap paint in order not to have to give a lot of stuff a second coat. But look at the difference here, how what a little bit of thick paint will do. It just completely gets rid of that lousy looking surface here. I'm going to have to razor blade that down. And then of course I'm doing the window sill. I just did the window sash. And when you do up underneath the window, you certainly want to get the very bottom of that. So, I'm using a three inch angle brush. This is an expensive brush. You can also use cheap brushes. But you get what you pay for in a brush. I try to take good care of my brushes. Now, I'm going to roll this wall out here. Kind of using a brand new roller head. They're only a dollar each. And I don't really wash them out. I throw them out. part about a new roller is you're not going to leave any calyps or dams behind when you're using it. And uh, One of the tricks is you don't want to spend a lot of time. You want to go relatively fast. And I'm working out this. Another nice thing is I'm staying very close to the same color of the house. And uh, Keep watching, take a look around this room, and we'll have this all done here in the next couple of days.